I am driving back. Um, the last video, it wasn't loud. Thought of a great title, but it wasn't loud. So the last two videos, like, like the last video had good content, um, but it wasn't loud. And I, that's also something I've been trying to avoid this whole series. So, like two videos in a row, ran into two things that I have been trying to avoid. And I, I think that's essentially it. Like, I've ended up with perhaps both of the things that I was trying to avoid. Um, the last video had volume issue, and the video before that, there were accuracy mistakes. And the last video, I put accuracy, I, I put like edits on stuff in the description too. Um, and actually, it was kind of fun doing that. Interestingly enough, so. And I was kind of over the top, or like, at kind of. Like, two miles, take exit six toward Minnesota 336 North. All the edits that I put in the last video, like, they're not like per se necessary, but. Um. I did not have sex tonight. Um, but that was not that that was like the goal, but just because like, and actually what I ended up doing was going to Bucks and like, and even I had actually like at one point, like I was just going to like not go dancing at all. Cause like I came down to like, I already met with who I like, I already like, last night already happened, that person already happened, and, like, that's what I, so, I was just gonna, I was thinking of just, like, going back, um, like, I already danced with her, like, that's what I came for, that's, that's what I came for, and that's, like, like, what it is, um, but the people I was staying with, um, I was able to give to do them a favor. A half a mile. Take exit six toward Minnesota 336 North. The people I was staying with, I was able to do the well, I, I guess both of them a favor, but um, maybe mainly so the the guy because he he worked today too, so I gave them a ride. Take to, exit six, then keep right at the fork. So then I gave them a ride to. Bucks, and they both. Ooh. Um, yeah, I gave them a ride to Bucks. Um, otherwise, he would have had to like walk for like an hour or something. I think is what he said. Um, in the morning, he asked if I could like keep right at the fork. In the morning, he asked if I could uh, like take. Let's see. Okay. Um, if I could continue take... on Minnesota 336 for two miles. In the morning, he asked if I could um, take him to the to drop something at the bank, but I didn't know if that'd be okay with, um, like if that'd be okay with the person uh, who's, I mean, it's his parents' car, but. So I messaged him, but I didn't hear back until they had already gone. Um, and they were gone for a while. Um, and they, they had said they were going to, he had said he was going to get like insomnia cookies or an insomnia cookie. Like he had asked what flavor I wanted. And I, I think I said, surprise me or something like that. Um, and, but he ended up coming back with like two packs of double stuffed Oreos, and that was sweet of him. Like years ago, like when the YMCA stuff was happening, um, Anna Hagen must have knew like a little. Like I, I wouldn't think everything, but she like knew of something. Maybe she saw something on Facebook because, like, I think we're Facebook friends now, so. 
I think. So we would have so would have been Facebook friends then, I think. So maybe she saw it on there. Um but like I was in Hornbachers years ago. Um somewhat around the time of this YMCA stuff, and her and her now husband walked in and I think she got him to get me like a thing of double soft Oreos. So interesting, like all these years later, like someone gets two packs of double soft Oreos, like that that touched me. Um in a quarter mile, turn right onto the US ten East ramp. And I, I've been like fighting annoyance with this GPS, but we've already talked about that in a previous video, so um Maybe even videos, but I think just one. Turn right onto the US 10 East ramp. Um, let's see. I did watch Boruto. Continue to on US oh 10 East gosh. for 60 miles. You just talk. Did you not just talk? Like, you just, like. Anyway, um, I did watch Boruto. Actually, I guess I can use this annoyance as, and this, this, well, now that I'm talking about it, it's like simmering down, but I can use annoyance as fuel to be louder, which is what I want to do. So, um, but now that I like talked about it, I think it's already like simmered down, but um, maybe if it happens again, I can utilize my annoyance as fuel to be loud. But I did watch Boruto. Okay, the annoyance is still there. Well, I guess, I don't know, when I think about it or something. Um, so I did watch Boruto. I watched like three episodes or something. Um, and it's interesting because they end up... At where I stopped, Boruto and Sarada are about to fight Deepa again. Like, the person that, like, messed with them and the reason they felt like they had to do all that training and now they find themselves back, like, like back in front of him again. And, like, when Shikadai helped Boruto with training... It was because, like, Boruto wasn't training to, like, go, like, try to challenge Deepa again. It was because, like, he felt like he couldn't progress from this point unless he got stronger than Deepa. Like, there was... It wasn't just for, like, revenge or, like, to go challenge Deepa again. It was, like, to progress in his own journey or something. Like, he needed to be strong. Like, he needed to be able to be... To be able to be able to be, not that he was going to go do it, or that to go find Deepa and, like, whatnot, but, like, he needed to, he needed to become strong enough to be Deepa, or to, he needed to strengthen up before, like, for him to be able to move on from this point, and good thing he did, because, lo and behold, he ends up fighting Deepa. And, like, that makes me think of my own journey and, like, am I, is all this, like, all this training, like, this series, like, am I gonna, am I gonna be fighting someone? I mean, not, I mean, shoot, I guess I could, like, with the fist styles and stuff, but, like, like, is there gonna be something where all this true heartfeltization storm stuff is, like, relevant or, like, Um, yeah, I, I just, like, I, just these last two videos have, like, make me feel, 
not strong in this series anymore. Like, there's been difficult, like, weird stuff that's been talked about in this series, but, like, when you have a video that, like, has all these, mis like, mis like, inaccuracies or, like, whatever or whatnot, um, like, does that mean there are other videos that have it? I mean, if they do, like, I've been taking care when talking, like, like, I'm aware of that that can happen. And it did. Um, so it, it is, it, it's, it's possible that it's happened in other videos. Um, but if it has, then at least, I mean, then I know that I like tried, like I worked against it, you know? Um, and like the house that I stayed in last night and ended up being into like seven something PM today, um, like to watch the video over again, like there's time for that. Cause it takes like three hours to upload. But at the place in Outer Tail, that's like an hour to upload. So like, gr well, okay, granted, if it's a 30 something minute video, take half of the next hour to watch it. So I, I mean, there's time even at Outer Tail's quicker Wi-Fi place. But um, Like, I don't know if I, like, I, I don't know if I want to, like, me, I mean, I guess I could, shoot, maybe I will, I guess I enjoy it, like, interestingly enough, like, I started to enjoy, like, when I edited, or when I put edits for this last video that had volume issue, like, I, like, I kind of enjoyed the, like, the process or part of the process or something, um, so maybe that could, should just be a thing for the rest of the series. Maybe not. It's like it's kind of up to me. Um, but yeah, both of it. Like, what else? What else was I worried about hitting the series? It was because I like the band, the inaccurate. Like, however I would have thought of it, or however I would have worded it, if I even thought of it. Um, but it, it was. I know what can happen with like. With the band from Fergo series as like a, as a past experience, like that and volume, those are like the two, like what else was there? Is there anything else I was scared of or worried about? I feel like those were essentially the worries and they both happened. And so now like my morale in this, like. And it's, it's not like this was a dancing with the fairy, like, series. Like, there's points in here that are questionable. Like, they, they end up in good places, like, but, so my, my morale is low, I suppose, as, as far as the series but maybe it shouldn't be like, I know, I mean, I don't, I feel like, I think I know that like powerful was done in this series. So if I make two videos that have issue, like, and maybe there's other issue that I don't even know, but like, at least I know that I tried and like, shoot, what if there's like a new issue that like, I didn't even know what happened that is that exists in this series. But today's technically Monday morning, 4.40, or sorry, no, and actually not sorry, but today is technically Sunday Sunday morning, 4.47 a.m., at least on the, on the car time, and uh, the car needs to be back by t by noon is what uh, what he said should be, according to him, that's what should be safe. Um so in my time there I visited that friend or danced with that friend that was the main purpose or what got me down there but um I didn't didn't go to a movie there isn't any discounted movies that I saw online I didn't go to the jazz thing tomorrow I didn't go to the play but even all that getting covid tested in like a short period of time that that's like a, a little bit of a process um, and then I don't even know 
like what my Sanford account password is or I don't know if like my account is uh I don't like if I have a Sanford account because I think you need that to check if you're positive or negative after you take the test um if I do have it I don't know if I know what the password is and all that stuff If I don't have it, then I guess I'll just have to make um, a new account, password, a username, or, or whatever aspects. But um, yeah. So I did. I did have. So I. So I was thinking of just going home because I already went and um I already danced with a girl yesterday and like maybe I should just like I already danced with Rachel maybe I should just uh like just like that's what I came for just was gonna be good off that um but then like I like the couple that I stayed with like I brought them to Bucks and then like I went into Bucks and then it was good like I ended up there were these songs that came on that reminded me of like things distant past like it was so I was appreciating that like um and it was a good it was a good time um and maybe already even then I was in that mindset of like as far as like downtown difficulties I talked about and like if I pre like appreciation and like um that type of stuff so I think I was already like in the mindset of stuff talked before um But, um, excuse me. Um, eventually there is this like group of attractive girls that were like good, that were kind of dancing in their own group and were good at dancing. And then I tried to just, I tried to appreciate like the friend that was dancing with me. And then there's another girl that was like dressed up for Halloween that like came and started dancing with me. And so I kind of tried to, like, appreciate what came. Um, and then, like, later on, like, there, there is at some point where, like, I, at some point I did, like, like, dance, like, at them or something. But there's a point where I, like, realized that I should, like, try to focus on, like, I don't know, like, what I've gotten or, like, to not, like just be like trying to like I, I kind of was able to center myself or just focus on like what's what has been happening so far or like not to focus on them or try to or centering we could we could say and so I was just doing my own thing and then they ended up coming like and we ended up dancing a lot like and I was like hype but like so it's interesting because like I like didn't I chose like instead of like chasing them or whatever, which maybe would have worked too, but like I just was doing me and then there was a time that they came onto the floor and like they didn't like directly like pay attention like they didn't like directly come and like super directly make me part of the circle or like super directly like talk to me or anything, but like the way they came on the floor was like it was like open to me or I don't like it was like it was it was different than how they were before I feel like if I'm yeah I, w I, w I think I would say um so yeah like I ended up dancing with them like a like a lot um so it's interesting that like how that worked out that way um and then there's this other group of people that I didn't, like, like, in this other group of people, two of them had walked by me when I was, like, sitting on the bench outside, like, maybe, maybe listening to the YouTube video before this, perhaps, um,
yeah, because when I was, because I was sitting, I was sitting on the bench outside Bucks for a while before I came in, and I think when I was doing that, like I did my tree ritual at one point, but I also uh, was, I think maybe just watching, I'm guessing the last video and like just going, like going through it. Um, um, so I, but I had seen like two of the people of this other group walk into Bucks, um, but I didn't like recognize who they were because apparently they're like, I, they're, um, they're, they're people that I know kind of, um, one or both of these two people. So, and these two people being part of a, um, part of like another group that was at Bucks. So like, so there are those two people in that other group. And then there is like two girls and a guy there too. So a woman and a man, that's the two people in this other group that I was talking about that I saw when they walked in and I think they I think they both were at this like brunch get together thing that I went to last year um at someone's place um but it was the man and the woman and then there was like two girls and a guy and a and a guy so it's man and a woman two girls and a guy and one of the girls called me over or like motioned me over and um then the woman like told me that like asked if i don't know how she maybe she asked like if i remembered her or like what i don't know she said something maybe asked if i remembered her or something to that effect and then um or maybe just told me right away or eventually but um So I ended up, and one of the girls might have been at that brunch too, um, but the other girl is in town for the for like two weeks from Massachusetts. Um, and so yeah, so I ended up, so like, I ended up dancing with like. Yeah, like, I even ended up slow slow dancing with one of the girls. Um, I didn't know who, like, who was in the relation, like, where the relationship was. Like, the man and the woman are, like, a relationship or, like, something, but, like, with the girls and the guy. Um, but the girl that isn't, I don't know if I knew, at some, at some point, like, I asked, I may have asked about, like, relationship stuff or something. Um... And apparently she's like on a break with someone. Um, and then the other girl and the guy in that group, like they're kind of dating or something. But after hanging out with them tonight, like they're, they're, for, they're into each other. Like they're like sexually, like they're or attractiveness wise. They're like really into each other. And even beyond that, like just well, like things that were said, like, and then apparently even the, the, the guy, like I got, there was a point when we were at Denny's that like, I heard of like a bad situation that had happened. I don't know if it's weeks ago or something, but like, but yeah, so dance at Bucks. And then this other group who I had started dancing with after like there was that initial group that I chose to center we'll say or chose to focus on like what had already been happening that night instead of like chasing something chasing attraction or these girls or whatnot and so there's that first group that I ended up dancing with but then this second group this other group with the the man the woman and the two girls and the guy um I ended up dancing with dancing with some of the people in that group maybe mainly the girls and the guy um and um there came a point where they wanted to go to the to go downtown 
And even though in the, I think the video before this, maybe I had said like, since I'm here and like before I was like with my sexual desire or whatnot that I was having, like if I happen to be downtown, like maybe, I, or if I happen to be in Fargo or in this, the way I said it might, might be that like, if I happen to be downtown, but I wasn't downtown when I was making that video. So if I, like, if I'm, if I'm here, then like, and like with what my spiritual sexual, like when I had that spiritual st sexual state earlier this week, it was like, if someone was to be at the house that I might've for forgotten marriage and like, just be in this like spiritual sexual state. And then like that there is someone who's potentially going to come clean in the weekend and how like like thinking of her and like if it's saturday or whatever and i end up being in fargo then like maybe i should go downtown type stuff but kind of like i said earlier i i at one point kind of just wanted to just go back i like i already danced with rachel like and to just go back but then um i was in the couple's place like all day like i left at seven something to drop them off at bucks and then like I I ended up doing my tree like maybe I parked like I parked at some point but before I actually went in I did like my tree ritual I was like sitting on the bench for a while maybe looking at my phone at the previous video or stuff like that um but Um, but I, ch I chose to, there's, there's a point or not, I chose to, but I mean, kind of, I chose to, but there was a, there's a point after dancing with that second group where they like wanted to go downtown. And so I, like, I agreed and I came with them. And so I got in their car and like, we all went to downtown and like, like I said earlier, initially, like I was thinking of just going home and then like I dropped them there and then I was like, I would have at least had to say, like walked in to say goodbye or something like that. Um, but I ended up going in and dancing and connecting to different songs from different things in the past or, or, or connecting to different stuff at least. Unless it was all the same stuff. No, it was. I feel like it was. I feel like it was different stuff. Um, but yeah, so I went downtown. Um, I ran into people when I was downtown. But whereas with this, with one of the girls from that second group, I had a good connection with them at Bucks. When we went to the OB, they were like really hanging out with this around with this other guy and like so um and then after the ob like we ended up going to denny's and then i ran into some bases that i had just seen downtown and um uh, so i didn't really end up getting to dance with that girl um but when we went to Denny's, um, the, the one, the guy that she had been talking to and stuff, like, offered to pay for my meal and stuff. And I, like, I brought up how, like, we both liked this girl. And, like, I made, like, a joke out of it about how, like, like how in Twilight, like, the, like those two because there's two male characters in Twilight that end up going after Bella. Um, so I, like, made a joke out of that, or, like... So I... And then I... Even even at the point that he, like, got the receipt for, like, how he was going to pay for me, the girl, and him, um, I said, like, you buying this doesn't mean that I'm not going to show interest or something like that in this, in this girl or something like that. Um, but then, like... So, but she was interested in that guy and like, she's like, it sounds like she's interested in hanging out with me. Like we exchanged numbers and like, um, I told her about like $5 movies and stuff and like, 
so she's she's interested in like hanging out with me but like she was like attracted to him and like the girl and the like the girl and the guy that were dating or kind of dating like they ended up talking about how like they're gonna have sex when they get back home and then like she was interested in him and like they're like it, it came to the point of like them talking about doing stuff or like it being hinted at when like they got back and um and the, but then when I when they dropped me off at Bucks, like I went back in the car to like try to give her a hug and like maybe she ex- like kind of did it a little bit or something, but maybe not. But like she like asked for a handshake, and that like kind of thro- like it, like that kind of throws me off, I guess. Um, but even let's say she was like attracted to me and she like was like ooh or what or like. I was attracted to her or whatever, like, still, like, cuddles, like, when I was in a spiritual sexual state earlier this week, like, um, I mean, I was in that, but, like, I'm not now, and even if, even if I was then, and then I had this, like, let's say I had a girl that was, like, interested in me, like, when I was in that spiritual sexual state, like, like, it's not, like, just to do, like, I'm not a do sex just to do sex person, even if there was someone that was, like, in the spiritual sexual state that I was in days ago, like, if, I don't know if it, like, how much of a right person it would need to be or what, but, like, It being today, though, and me not being in that spiritual sexual state, like, it, even even if hypothetically she was, like, fawning over me or implying that she wanted to do something with me, like, I don't want just, like, uh, just sex to, like, as, like, the way that, the way that people do sex, or, like, that it's just, like, like a 